Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Ben the Human Plays Mind Over Magic. We got a lot of stuff going on right now. I'm still trying to entice my stupid students to feed this crone bug. What are you doing? Providing affection. I don't want you to care for it. I want you to make frost glass. Is that a different priority? Like beast care. What does this do? Keep them happy. What about like making stuff? Is that... How about hauling? Maybe that's carrying or teleporting items. We should also put that as high. Not, not so you kill yourself about it. Olive, where are you going? She did a thing. What did you do? I think you just fed him. Somebody feed, like he's been fed. Don't feed him and then don't give him ice stuff. Holy God, what is happening? All students. Like they're all in class right now. I don't care about the ignium. I want to make frost class. It's paused. I'm an idiot. <laughs> It's been paused since last episode, too, so you guys are going to comment being like, you're an idiot. Uh, and I built my roof wrong. Oh, I'm devastated. Dang it. Hold on. I think we can fix this. Everything's a, everything's a mess. <laughs> At least he's making frost glass, though. Oh, my God. That's been like that for an entire episode, and I've been complaining about it the whole time, too. Nothing is more Ben than that. Oh, we should uh, get rid of you. You're just taking up space. Oh, the, the dude! This guy's alive! He totally moved. Go back 30 seconds. You, you'll see. I'm staring at him. There he is! He scratched his butt! You saw it! Living... Proof. Lofted private. It's dark in there, though. Dimly lit. There are gonna be void shrooms in there until we get the requisite frost glass. We're down- we're- we have eight to go! Please keep delivering things to crone bugs so we can get this frost glass off the ground. What was I going to do with this room? Oh, right. I was going to make you into another advanced school room. Like this guy. Oh, there's space for another teaching thing. Let's see. We have the fire. We have the air. Let's do earth. Right there. Yeah, that'll work. Cool. So that's three of our seven things we can teach. This room will be the exact same footprint as the room below it. This guy down here. So we need, we'll need to get more space. Oh, something I hadn't considered. Well, we, no, we can't. I wonder if I open this wall, will this make this part of the advanced classroom? If I get rid of this learning stone, because you can't have an advanced classroom with a learning stone in it. I'm kind of tempted to get rid of this this learning stone once this room is done up here. Uh, get rid of that learning stone, and then once the other three are built, put the final element on this platform up here. Get rid of this part of the wall, and see if that makes this one giant advanced classroom. I don't know if it'll work that way, but I kind of I I want to see it eventually. Now let's get the roof correct. Great. Perfect. That, that's exactly what we want to see. The other thing I want to test out, though, is if I delete this wall, what does that do to the structural integrity of this part? We can test that by demolishing just the, the one block. A battle awaits. Oh, right, the four skull battle that I'm never going to touch until I have, like, Gandalf on my team. Uh, but we should get down into the dungeon. Oh, it's right before bedtime, though. People are going to be tired. Let's wait till next time. I should have sent them before before night fell. That's my bad. We also need to get up here and build this uh, lightning rod. 
I think we could do that by moving this out of the way. Or maybe cancel move. Can I build the stairs high enough? Oh, I can. I think. Sometimes the stairs, depending on what I built around the stairs, it won't finish. All right. What is the structural integrity? It is not structurally sound. Okay. So rebuild this. Or... Try the large arch support. Because what is the... I think we... Yeah, we just need to push it out a little further. So... Philippe... What are you doing? He's exhausted. I'm gonna make I'm gonna make him be continue to be exhausted. I want him to construct this so I can mess around with this tomorrow. Did our crone bug finish his thing? Yes, crone bug did his job. Look at that big old window. Very cool. Did we get the? We did. We got the honey drop. Throw that under the shelf here. Yeah, it's like right there. Everything's all crowded over there in the corner anyway. <laughs> it's gonna look weird. Oh, he did the thing. Okay, great. Did it work? It did! It's barely structurally sound, but it is! Alright, somebody get in here, demolish this whole wall. Finish that roof, and now we've got the makings of a new advanced classroom. We need to get a chalkboard in there, uh, and a bunch of bookshelves. But otherwise, I think this room is, is going to be ready to go. Mana Lantern is useful. I should probably throw a Mana Lantern down in here, too. At least one. Like, where, like maybe under the staircase? There? <laughs> I don't know. Is that a good place for it? We should build another... Oh, the, do you think this is gonna protect this roof? I guess we'll see. Why don't we let these lightning rods be once I get the staircase built up here? And see, like, does this protect this part of the school and that part of the school? This building should be set forever. It's got, it's got two lightning rods on it, and it's very short. <laughs> but I guess we'll see how the lightning behaves. It, it might not follow the rules I, I assume it'll follow. You going well? How are you doing? You don't have any fibrous textile. Lots of stuff queued up. Everybody's awake, so let's go ahead and get ready to explore the stone ruins. We would like to just knock out each level as we go down. Rather than uh, continue to, s to delve into the spine. I, I like to knock out each level before before going further. We do have two students that are completely done with training. With no students present. Hmm. Charge a mana lantern and then defeat two one skull or higher enemy parties. Guess we could do that. This is a a wild room. Uh the striga is gonna be the strigoi is gonna be pretty dangerous. But let's boost you two. And then go ahead and torrent the fur. We can't kill the furry mite. Although we can. If we have Philippe attack it. What do you do? Attacks all enemies. I think it's worthwhile to kill you and not let you attack everybody. This guy's still going to attack everybody, but at least we limited the damage. All right, Andrew, you kill this guy now. You only get to attack that guy, the team, once. Alright, and Philippe's gonna have to tank some stuff for us. Oh, they actually shot the other person, so... Torrent, you? I should have attacked you with, uh... With Yale. That was a bad play, because we could have stopped them from attacking entirely. That's okay, we'll get through this. Yes. And then you're dead. 
I don't think we would have been able to stop this one from attacking anyway. We could have gotten it to die on its turn, I think, but uh, it doesn't really matter. All right, good job, team. Ooh, ice pedal. More frost glass, perhaps? More stone ruins. No research selected. All right, what do we want to work on? We got, we've got the anemone planter, which means we need to plant it. We don't have rune wood, and we don't have un unstable anemone spore. That means we just need to go out and harvest anemone. So we'll we'll queue up some of that. What what's good? Like a lot of this is just like extra stuff. I feel like we're kind of like reaching the tail end of what like makes sense for for us. This one we still need a crazy amount of arcane scrolls. Um so I guess we'll just keep fighting in the underschool. But for now, I guess like you're all done, right? So we got everything that we could reach search. I guess we don't have the tender. Let's go ahead and finish that one. It's going to finish in like two seconds anyway. Insufficient ingredients. Susan completed bronze trial. Well done. Ah, pet, pet the thing. Defeat a one skull or higher enemy party. No research selected. We finished the research immediately. Like I said we would. Alright, we're back into the research tree. We could do the rest of these potions here. These are all sealed off. We could push down to... Terrarium, terrorium, and uh, domesticated rune wood. That's not a bad idea. Just because it'll, you know, give us time. This one's sealed off still. This one's sealed off. We could do huge ornate rug, which takes a lot of fibrous textile. This one's sealed off. Yeah, we're like reaching the limit of what we're capable of doing. I guess we could do it really tied the room together. Very, uh... The dude from Big Lebowski. Um, we'll do that one, just because it's, like, easy access to more luxury. Can somebody finish this? I swear. No? I guess Philippe is, is like, our primary constructor. There's a gremlin in here. Yeah, where do you keep coming from? I wonder if it's because these gutberry have just been lying on the ground and there's nowhere to store them. Oh, you know why? It's because we queued you up as no no meals. We do need to put gutberry somewhere. So now the gutberry is just lying on the ground and that's where the gremlin keeps coming from. I understand. All right, Andrew, kill this dude again. Ooh, what did we unlock? Oh, that's right. We unlocked the the anemone, which we don't have rune wood or spores for. Also, the fog is in too close that we can't push it back. We need spore cap and honey drop. All right, we'll just need to have to. We either wait till it comes in and changes the requirement, or we need to get more of those. All right, gremlin is dead. the The little picker uppers are picking up the gut berry. We should go ahead and add our tender. Yeah, the fertilizer here. So recycled quilter, fertilizer. And just one, do until one. And then we should do the normal fertilizer or and the normal harvester. Oops, sorry. On. There we go. And then one of the other ones as well. One quilted harvester, one quilted fertilizer. Do until, do until. Good. And that's Gwen's job. That's her other job. She's supposed to ward things and she's supposed to summon quilted. Skill level learned. Well done. In an intermediate classroom. Wall rested. There's so many like things to do there. I'm pretty happy with my teachers, though. Two idle students? Well, whatever. Back into the exploration. Andrew's fine. 
The leap, the leap's back to full. Let's swap out Yale and uh, Jess for Gwen and Byron, maybe? And then let's have Gwen in the front. This is kind of like an offensive squad here. It'll be interesting to see what we go up against. Get on in there. I think it's a middle of class, too. Or maybe not. Oh no, it's uh, that was doing doing chores time. Hey, they finished the room. Thank you. Now, how do we set it up to be an advanced room? I think we want to move you to the back just to get you out of the way. Or maybe over here. And then move you to the other side. Whoa! That was rude. Uh, let's go for the f initial tentacle lash. Or no, Andrew's gonna be able to... Well... No, let's do the initial tentacle lash. Hit with earth armor. You already hit, took a hit, but it's fine. Uh, Andrew finished her off. Good. So you don't even get a chance. And then fireball. Crit! Fantastic. Suck it. Armor is better than not armor. And then, I guess, just a smash for fun. And then finish her off with the multi-strike. Yeah, we've reached the point where two skull combat really isn't too much of a trouble. Got a lot of revival flask, some honey drop. I'll always take more arcane. The leap is starving. Who knew? Didn't you should, you should have eaten your breakfast, you weirdo. All right, let's take Philippe. Have him eat some food. Oh, there's nothing in that pantry. Well, where's our food? Have some carcass stew, I guess. Do we only have one cook? I know fire is the cooking ability. Because we have assembly. Painting. Hauling. Oh no, you're air, duh. Uh, Byron. Yeah, you're the cook. Yeah, it looks like that is your only job. <laughs> Jess's job is to mine and do alchemy and carve, repair, and clean, actually. So that's not too bad. And then I guess we could give her research as well, since she does that faster. So that's something. All right, so we want to make bookcases. So let's go ahead and copy you and just do like two of you there. Can I copy you, build copy? Just slap that down on that wall there. I think that's everything it needs, right? Let's go just take a look. You still don't have the infirmary? Do I, does the infirmary or does the... The hospital ward have a luxury requirement? No? Two medical beds, four incense burners. Oh, I see. A uh, build copy. Just throw them on the sides here. Like, let me build, let me build. There, all right, now I think that'll be done. And now the, not the ritual room, but the teaching room, classroom. Advanced classroom, two bookshelves, yep chalkboard and then skill specific teaching station so i think if we just start throwing nature because oh, and lightning so yeah nature you need a lot of space up in here are you too tall Listen, oh it's because the staircase is in the way uh, hmm Well, why don't we do this? I have an idea. Now that you're done, I can actually deconstruct you. And then I'm actually thinking I could re-deconstruct this whole thing. 
uh, move this over here, put a normal staircase along the back wall so it's not taking up the main space. So this is a little He didn't finish the job. <laughs> there we go. Did you? No, he still didn't. Andrew, please. Oh, you're doing the other one. All right, well, whatever. That'll get done eventually. We'll we'll take down this spiral stair and we'll put in a normal staircase. Okay, they did do it. All right, thank you. Move this over here now. I put it on the wrong part of the room. I think this will work, because, like, if I do stairs like so... I got to flip it around. Like, like such. Yeah, I think that'll work. You can still get in. We'll have to move this uh, bookcase, but... Torch snuffer! Oh, actually, this is a great time to send whoever wanted to kill solo people. Solo? You're a water user? But you're only a level one. One skull without using potions. Quinn does that's that doesn't really matter. Solo as well. Without an ally going con unconscious. Alright, Patrick. You might not survive this. This is your best shot to kill the Torch Snuffer. Oh, Torch Snuffer is a level 2 wand user. Or, uh, Earth wand. Uh, not Earth. Uh, level 2 skull enemy. I did not realize that. I thought they were a single. But we should bring Susan with us. Like so. She might die. But I think she'll be okay. Let's give that a shot. Meanwhile, let's go ahead and... I'm going to trap, like, Violet up in the room upstairs. But I want to get this staircase situated. The way I want it to. Like so. And then... I think I can move... Yeah, there's still space on that wall. So let's move you, like, right... There. There. And then we'll have to move this torch, perhaps. Between you two. Does that look okay? Yeah, I think that's fine. Alright, Torch Snuffer, you've met your end of days. There's a messy meddler with you as well. But, I think we'll be okay. Especially because Philippe's gonna take a lot of aggro here. Shadow Cloak. Earth armor. And then multi strike. Not a problem. Not a problem. Uh, we'll go for the fireball. Maybe we'll get lucky. Did not. But we'll go for the tentacle lash. Bit of overkill, but that's fine. And then go a smash on this guy. And then Andrew will finish him off. Good job. Got some ectoplasm. Hollow lily bloom. Cool. You broke my red wall torch. No. I just like need all the arcane scrolls now. I guess I should go back to farming the, the lava bug. Do all you can drink. We're very close to being able to unlock dark arts, but that only gets you down to darker and darker. Scrumptious. Like, that one would be nice, but there's... <laughs> we're, we're many arcane scrolls away from being able to do that one. I guess we should do this stuff, because we don't. it doesn't require any, uh, any scrolls there. Advanced classroom. Very cool. Oops, we accidentally broke the floor. There, fix that. Furniture? New furniture? Ooh, more rugs. Very cool. And then I think we unlocked... What was the other teaching thing? Lightning? Nature? Earth? Air? Fire. Okay, lightning up here.
What should we put you in here? I think right there is ideal. And then we'll move this Lana, Lana Lantern? <laughs> lantern out of the way. St I like to stick on the Mana Lantern under the staircase for some reason. I just kind of like where it fits back there. Like so. And then we'll be able to nature, lightning, fire, air, earth. So that means we're missing water and darkness. Ooh, the water though, we would rather have in its own room. Like maybe we turn this into a room because we want to make the hydro laboratory. And it just has to be elevated. I don't, this won't work. But we could make, we could do a weirdo offshoot where it's like out over nothing here. And that would be elevated, I think. Right? Is that what elevated means? No foundation underneath you? No adjacent rooms or foundation below. Yeah, so there can be rooms below you, which is how these work. Yeah. Oh, this should not be Byron. This should be assigned to Gwen. And then not students. Yes. How are you coming on the next textile? You have two textile. We need three more. <laughs> Hospital ward. Very cool. Now, now people be healing like crazy. And then the banners, of course, but that's going to be like a long term thing because you need 10 textile per banner unless we want the ground ones. But like it's already crowded on the floor as it is, although maybe we have enough luxury. It's at 70 luxury, actually. So maybe we could do the ground banner. Just, like, get rid of some of those pedestals in the back. Rain falls. A battle awaits. It's the four skull battle that I will not touch. At least not for a while. What happened with this floor? You see this? Oh, there's still a... a still a chunk of staircase in there. <laughs> no wonder the the bookshelf hasn't moved appropriately. Is that what that is? Shrink bookshelf unreach unreachable. Oops. There. Why is there a third bookshelf up there? Who knows? I love the sound of thunder. Do you guys like thunder? In real life? Oh, we should have another of another painting here. Yeah, painting room. We talked about that last uh, last episode, and I didn't do it. Is everybody asleep? Who's making this awful noise? What are you doing? This guy is perpetually replanting the, the bitter rice and the crow are out here eating the bitter rice. This is ridiculous. Fantastic. Willow, you should probably be our other cook. I know we had you as like repair, mining and harvesting and whatnot. But I think repairing and cooking are like your primary jobs now. We have other p other teachers that can cook better than you. This is the I think this is in the way. The bookshelf is unreachable. Cannot reach for spell. Why can you not reach this room? Did I screw up the pathing here? Pathing? Oh, is it blocked off by the... It sure is. Rats. Hmm. That's not great. It's the only way I can fit people in there. Ah, that sucks. What if I just move you to the other side of the room for now? 
And then honestly, we should move you over one. And then we'll be able to sh whatever we build on the other side, we'll be able to shuffle that over one. And then I think there'll be a path back there. All right, we screwed that up a little bit. My bad. But the castle is looking pretty nice. I'm pretty happy with how everything looks here. Still only two fibers textile though. Got all these set up. The, this this room should be done. It is. It's a painting studio. How cool. And then uh, the we don't have access to carving yet, but it should be pretty easy to do the carving workshop too, I think. If we go down here. Sculpture studio. Just one huge window and... Many statues. <laughs> so maybe we would add that like, like over here, just on its own. Because it's got to be grounded, and there's not a lot of rooms that are grounded. I wonder if we could set it up down here. Like, if we look at this underschool chamber, it is grounded. Underground and grounded. It's an interesting idea. I know I saw people on the subreddit Reddit talking about building in the underschool, and people are like, it's just not worth it. But it could be interesting. I don't know. Nothing else going on in my school. <laughs> All right, we've set up the, the room again. Why are you not working anymore? Hold on. Towered, lofted, private. It's the, here, towered. Oh, you have to have three bookshelves. Oh, that's where that other bookshelf was supposed to go. Could we build one large bookshelf now? Oh, we have a shrunken bookshelf, no wonder. All right, we'll just throw that down there for now and then that'll fix that. This room we're not doing anything with, so. I might chunk out this wall and turn this into something. I don't know what I would turn it into. Maybe that's where our hydro laboratory- No wait, the hydro laboratory needs to be elevated. We have a calming large rug. I don't know where to put that. Put that under your summoning thing. Why not? Sure. <laughs> I don't know why I even have a calming large rug. Oh boy. All right, let's end the episode on one more combat here, huh? Send our dudes down. Let's, uh, no, Philippe's here. Let's send, uh, Yale. We're doing, like, the A squad with the, the fire, air, nature, earth. Two of every potion except for revival. I've, I don't even think I've ever actually used a revival potion. To be honest with you. But honestly, like, if this is how the school finishes, I'm pretty happy with it. It looks pretty nice. Got these cool bedrooms over here. Got, like, some crazy architecture going on. We were able to, like, s carve out a weirdo intermediate room. We have a good advanced room, a second advanced room up here. And then we'll be able to do our hydro laboratory offshoot once we have, like, those rocket things that, like, support things in the air. Hey, don't attack my Earth Wand user when they don't even get to go yet. Alright. Go ahead and multi-strike this guy to death. And then, Andrew, you wipe this guy out, and we'll, we'll go for... Actually, Fireball's fine, because you might kill him. You did. Uh, I was thinking a Fireball would be fine, because then we could have had Yale kill him with the growth or something. Um, on the other hand, let's just hit you with a growth. Armor is great. Armor is greater. Alright, go ahead and do it again. So you're down to 10 armor. I'm gonna go for the multi-strike to finish you off. And then we'll just start stacking damage on you. Another crit. Fantastic news. Another growth. Smash for fun, and then uh, multi-strike. Cool beans! Got some honey drop, that's cool. Some wood. Oh, three skull, very exciting. Okay, well, we'll leave that there. If you guys enjoyed the episode, click the like button, it helps me out a lot. If you want to see more Mind Over Magic or the other videos I have going on on the channel, subscribe to the channel, that also helps me out a lot. But until next time, everybody, I hope you have a good one, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody!